December 26, 2011. NASA's Terra satellite passes high over the South Atlantic Ocean and captures this image. It appears to be a giant whirlpool of glowing blue light. I've seen motion whirlpools before, but I've never seen anything on this scale before. Who or what is actually making this light up? You can't believe that this is actually something that exists for real in the ocean. The whirlpool, or whatever it is, is located 500 miles off the coast of South Africa. And it's huge, stretching as far as 100 miles. The image seems to indicate a whirlpool the size of an entire state. Well, that's pretty scary. But it's not just the scale that's astonishing analysts. Why is this thing, whatever it is, glowing blue? One possible reason that you might be able to see this phenomenon in the photograph is because this ocean vortex has sucked up millions upon millions of microorganisms, otherwise known as phytoplankton. Phytoplankton are organisms that emit a bright blue light. Everything in these ocean vortexes are trapped. So they're spinning and you have millions of billions of gallons of water, marine plankton, debris, and they're moving across oceans from continent to continent and nothing gets out. But it's just a theory. No one has seen anything quite like this before. A massive ocean vortex, if that's what it is, can be created by an earthquake on the ocean floor. On March 11, 2001, a magnitude 9 earthquake takes place 43 miles off the coast of Japan. The result? One of the biggest tsunamis ever recorded. Waves 130 feet high pummel Japan's mainland, creating deadly whirlpools along the coast which suck fishing boats down beneath the waves. But these whirlpools are tiny in comparison to the glowing monster captured on satellite. And no tsunami or earthquake has been recorded off the coast of South Africa. The blue spiral of light caught on satellite camera looks like something from a sci-fi movie. Analysts have not encountered anything quite like this before. It looks too big to be a whirlpool. There have been no recorded earthquakes in the area, and there are no unusual weather reports from shipping in the region. The blue vortex remains a mystery.